truth is living in authenticity. We like to say that we value truth, we value honesty, but sometimes it's difficult to really understand if you value it when it benefits you or when it doesn't benefit you. Two plus two equals four, but there's also your own truth, and so you have to speak that. I think we're spot on with picking that topic as it pertains to social justice issues. It's truly an excellent time to examine this idea of truth. I think the value in Wimester is that it allows everyone to come together around a particular theme and really take a deep dive. Well, this year's theme was selected because if you're paying attention at all to the world around us, there is this extreme divergence of views. What I am excited for this semester is the conversations. The thing I'm most excited for is the challenge. I think if we want any sort of change whatsoever, we definitely have to be willing to um, roll with the punches and take the challenge. A lot happened in the last um, year, especially with politics. I'm, I'm a big <laughs> advocate for politics, and so I think having those difficult discussions will be an exciting thing to have this semester. I think our goal working in higher education is to provide students with the opportunity to build upon their critical their critical thinking skills and, and prepare them for a life after Washburn. One of the things that I think is so important about not only Wilmester but liberal arts education in general is that it really provides students with space to grapple with these issues. I do know that this year too we have probably more faculty than ever who will make Moomester activities a part of their course. Be creative, leave no stone unturned, and then in some ways think like a student. Think like the 19-year-old um, the who is brilliant and curious. I'm going to offer a class, Visual Anthropology, that's focused on understanding how the media construct notions of truth. So students will gain tools like learning how to use semiotic analysis and discourse analysis in order to better understand how do media create messages and how do audiences receive that. When you talk about social justice, sometimes people get uncomfortable, but you know, I definitely would encourage people to lean into the discomfort. My hope is that people will be open to constructive criticism and be open to understand that something that you may have valued at the beginning can change. I think Washburn University does a really, really great job of really challenging its students um, to think critically about these adaptive issues um, and how to really come at it from a leadership perspective, but also how to really enact that systematic change and sustainable change that's essential um, to really solve any problem. We won't always share the same opinion, and that's okay. What you have to do is learn to be open and objective enough to understand that truth is different for other people and different from their lens. That the very reality that you live in is not necessarily the same reality for all students or for all people.